First, congratulations for Newcastle for go through. Uh, big compliment I said in the locker room to the, the players for the way we played comparing last season. So that uh, we were there, but we didn't play absolutely anything. Today we were there. We make a brilliant first half, and of course for the way we play. I think Newcastle could not accept. They increased the rhythm, the aggressivity, and the kicking, and they were there, more aggressive. And we struggled a little bit, but it was normal. I said at the time, so we will not be the second half than the first, so we have to be there in the bad moment. We were there, and yeah, I mean, at the end, we could not win with the crowd. And yeah, as I said, congratulations, Newcastle, for possible. Do you think they surprised your players a little bit? Because they were quite, Newcastle, I mean, they were quite passive in the first half and then seemed to shift to a slightly more aggressive approach. Yeah, Bruno, the impact was important. The Joel Inton, as always, uh, is important. So, yeah, they make a step forward. Well, we knew it. So when we play against Newcastle in the past, always was like that. It was not a surprise. But you have incredible positive things for many, many players, a good play. And, and yeah, so competitions. We won the Super Cup, European Super Cup. We have three more competitions to play. And, and uh, yeah, for the rest of the teams, good luck for the Carabao Cup. Absolutely, Oscar was more than brilliant. In all the departments, defensive, defensive. The game, the guy he's played is unbelievable, and Sergio played really good. And yeah, all of them, all of them played really good. Rick as well, and central defenders. Everyone was really, really good. This game means Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you think the target was win the quadruple? Honestly, it's not. We compete really good. That is what I to my team, and and uh, and we are more than satisfied to win the treble. Our expectations are high, but not high enough to to make the other one satisfied for that. So never was in our mind. So we came here to play and we compete really good and, and that's all. All right. Um, we're very um, we're animated on the touchline thanks to the second half and then we yellow card. Why was that? Well, I don't know how many faults they did, how many faults we had, we did, and we have, uh, I don't know, the double of yellow cards, so. So, but it is what it is. So sometimes emotions are there. So respect for the referees, that's all for the job, and well deserved the yellow card again. So that's all. No. No. No, no, I thought, I thought uh, Kyle was a lot of minutes, Kyle, uh, Erling a lot of minutes and and we have a lot of games ahead of us. Of course, maybe I, yeah, maybe I could think in the last 10, 15 minutes, but I decided to do it. And is it a concern? Most of you, it's a bit sort of a bell for Is it a concern? Maybe there weren't too many other goals or is it not so? We have scored a lot of goals since I arrived here. You see the statistics, how many goals they score. With different strikers, without the strikers, with wingers, different wingers, some attacking midfielders. So. But Newcastle is a top side. Defensively, are so strong in all departments. They work really, really well. Everybody knows it, so it's not easy to do it. But I have time to have our chances for the last pass, the last action. And, uh, and this is what I'm looking for for my team. Uh, there's a lot of focus on Calvin Phillips. Stay. Play really good, really, really good. It's not easy when you have a lack of rhythm or lack of tempo. The minutes you play, they did it. So play really good. Did he do it all to put him into consideration for the uh, Yeah, absolutely. Everyone, everyone has the the chance. So we have time now. Come back, recovery, and we have time to think about it. Yeah. Um, Oscar has played the uh, right wing usually. Um, can you see how he handled uh, that? 
Uh, he played number 10, he played a striker, he played a winger, so we know him that in, in the pockets, in the middle, he moved really well, and we need that his intensity has done. He works without the ball, the tempo he does is amazing, and his ability in the sport, right? In the first half, was an action that you went around with Julian, was a little bit shy, you know, because that situation, that the way the defender defend, he should have finished the action, but it's normal, so in that age, and it happened, but uh, he has already played 96 minutes, and that is really good. You said that uh, Kyle and Ruben was uh, exhausted uh, earlier this week. Uh, is the same situation for early now? Or? There are guys that play a lot of minutes. Ruben a lot, and Kyle with the national team 118, and yeah, and decide with this lineup. So, we always have done that in the Carabao Cup since the day one arrived. So the Carabao Cup always play the players who never let regularly then play. If you go through, go through, go through. When you arrive semi-finals, final after I take, okay, now I'm going to try to win it. But I don't want to waste energy in this competition in that stage. Unfortunately, we have a lot of injuries that the guys who have not played today have play, but today play guys like no play regularly and play a good minutes. And unfortunately, I should play Manu Akanji that I would like to rest. But uh, yeah, that was the decision as always I've done. Okay, guys, thank you.